Hello everybody and welcome to my let's play of Reketeer. Um Just so that you all know, I'm not giving up on my let's play of Terraria. I'm just holding off on that until they get in some big updates where I have something new and cool to show you like an awesome boss or new zones or something something I'm just I'm just holding off a little bit so that it doesn't get stale on you guys um, but this game um, I don't know how far I'll get in this game it's just I'm taking a little break here I'm trying something new uh, so this is Reketeer and I am Cintiq I'll be bringing you an item shop RPG sounds a little weird um, I have played it a little bit um, over a year ago but uh, I still remember most of what I need to do to play the game. So let's go ahead and start. So what we have here is a little event here. I could skip through it, but we'll let you see the people here. Here we have Tyr. Um, she's a bit of a lone shark. And she has uh, secured a loan on the next characters here, Reckett. Um She's secured a loan on their family, and she is responsible for collecting it. Uh, the family is unable to uh, pay the loan, though, so Tyr is assisting them raise money to pay off the loan. And so here we have our little intro thing. Um, Tyr's all business, and wreck -It is uh, likes food, sleeping, and just... In general, she acts like an airhead. So, anyways, they're going downstairs to open up their store for the very first day. All right. So we got our store, and if you can notice there in the background, we have no actual, uh, no actual merchandise. Yep, and that's what they're about to talk about now. No merchandise, no business. And they're saying, "Let's go to the Merchants Guild. That's who we are. We're merchants, so we are." part of the Merchants Guild. We have 1,000 picks. Uh, that's our unit of currency in this game. And we also have this worn sword, which costs 140. We have this long sword, which costs 840. Um, let's see what else we have here. Um, I skipped through it really quick, but Tier recommends that we get about 10 items to start off with. We want... Let's go ahead and get a worn sword. A, oh, I'm sorry there. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get a leather glove. Some clothes. Some scrap plates. A wooden armband. And let's go ahead and get a wool hat. And a... We want a higher end item there, so that way we have something to attract customers. So let's go ahead and get a souvenir charm. There we go, and we only have 20 coins left. So let's go ahead and leave. We don't... Alright, yeah, blah, 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 blah. And he's like, oh yeah, thanks. Here's some bread. Alright, capitalism, ho! And something about Adam Smith would be proud of us. I still can't go anywhere except back to our shop. And so we're back in the shop. A little tutorial here that will explain to us on how to put items down for the very first time. Blah, 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 blah. All right, here we go. We are going to put items down, and we have an item we can put here. This is our front window. We want to put our best items in the window. So, like our souvenir charm. We're going to put the souvenir charm down. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Stop talking. All right, now, let's see here. That's 100, 200, 200. 100, 200, 150, 250. There we go. So we're going to put down our 250. That 200 item. Another 200 item. And then everything else doesn't really matter where it goes. So 
just make sure everything is put down. I think that wooden armband... Oh no, it was 150, my bad. Everything's placed down. And here we go. Alright, that should do for displaying our wares, yeah. Let's sell some stuff. Yeah. Time to sell stuff. And so a little lady comes in. She's all like, Hey, you didn't do anything, just ask. She's like, Ooh, I need some bread. I need some bread. So we're going to raise the price to 110%. She'd probably go as high as 120, but let's just do this. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Exactly. See? That simple. I just made some money. I sold stuff. Yeah, me. I sold stuff. Hey, dear. Hi. I'm so happy. I did it. I did it, Papa. I did it. Yeah. And now I think she's about to... Yeah, she's about to waste part of the day here reminiscing. We started an item shop. Yeah. No, I'm not really wondering why we started an item shop. I've already told everybody. It's the family owes money and Brackett's got to pay it off. Dad's missing. He, he can't pay it off, so Racket needs to pay it off. And I, they never even mentioned mom or any siblings or anything like that. So I gotta assume that it's just been her and her dad up until now, or until recently. Yeah. Some credits here. A tale of fairy, a girl, and an item shop. Oh, and how to run an item shop. Okay. Uh, it just needs to hurry up here. Racketeer! I enjoy this game. I do. I just hate tutorials in general. Flashback! Let's see here. Yup, the calendar says it's been three months since Papa left. I don't get why he suddenly said, I'm gonna be a hero. Because he owes a shit ton of money. And he needs to pay it off. And then took off without saying when he'd be back. I really hope he's okay. I'm getting lonely. <laughs> well, I shouldn't worry too much about him. The best thing about him is how tough he is. He'll be okay. Ooh, somebody's knocking at the door. What? Yeah. Yeah. She's not. Hi. Who is it? There's nobody there. Wait, what? At my feet? It's a fairy! Good evening! Um, are you Mademoiselle Reckett Lemongrass? Uh, Miss Fairy? Pardon me, but I am the one asking questions. Again, you are Reckett Lemongrass? Grass? Uh, yes, I'm Reckett. My name is Tyr. I am an agent from Terma Finance Company. Oh, Finance Company? I'm here to collect payment on a loan paid out to your father. Here's the contract and my identification. Uh, yeah, so notice, Reckitt doesn't even read the contract. Loan, repayment, I... In plainer terms, I'm here to get our money back. If you are incapable of facilitating repayment, this house will be seized as collateral in order to repay the loan. Facilitating collaterals? Sees? What? Okay, and then Wreck-It goes off into Imagination Land. Therefore, I'm gonna get sold off in parts to distant foreign lands, repay Papa's debts. I wonder if I can survive with only two internal organs. Maybe if I eat a lot of spinach, that can replace my blood. Oh, but I don't want to be a sailor! What am I gonna do? 